Today we continue amino acid metabolism with the metabolism of basic amino acid. There are mainly two basic amino acid. One is lysine. The second is arginine. They both are essential amino acid. In these two amino acid, lysine is a ketogenic amino acid, while arginine is a gluco genic amino acid so lysine it's an essential amino acid this is very important it's deficient in cereals this is the thing it becomes a um, limiting amino acid in cereals like cereals contains all the amino acid except lysine it is metabolized directly without undergoes transamination. We have seen in the metabolism that the very first step for the metabolism of amino acid that is transamination. But there are a few exceptions that is lysine, threonine, and proline. The lysine is degraded to acetyl CoA, hence it is a ketogenic because you can say you can say that acetyl CoA is essential for the synthesis of ketone bodies. Now we'll see the role of lysine. Lysine and the hydroxylysine, they are essential part of the structure of collagen and elastin. The negative charge present on the epsilon amino group it forms an ionic linkage with the oppositely charged group of the other amino acid in the protein structure. It forms ionic bonds. The epsilon amino group is important in forming skip based linkage during the trans amino reactions. And slicing is found in the large quantities in the histone, that is a structure that is put in present in the DNA. And this slicing is also a precursor of carnitin. Carnitin that helps in the transport of fatty acid during the beta oxidation. Arginine that is considered as a semi essential amino acid, which is a glucogenic by metabolism. This arginine formed in the urea cycle. Then, while that is acted upon by the arginase enzyme that is present only in the river, and it splits this arginine to urea and ornithine. This arginine is metabolized to glutamate. That is glutamic acid, which is transaminated to alpha ketoglutaric acid. This alpha ketoglutaric acid enters into the TCA cycle as an intermediate, goes to the oxaloacetate and forms a glucose. Hence, this arginine is a glucogenic amino acid. Role of arginine first of all, it is essential for the hero formation in the urea cycle. Arginine reacts with the glycine and methionine, that is acid mutual methionine, to form a creatine that we have already seen in the metabolism of glycine as well as in the methionine. And this arginine is very, very important as a precursor of nitric oxide. It is an important signal molecule in the body, an important neurotransmitter that helps in the vasodilatation. In the next video we will see about the nitric oxide in detail. So this is a brief about the metabolism of basic amino acid that is lysine and arginine. Then we talk in detail about nitric oxide in the next video, next lecture. Okay, thank you. For more updates visit this page in StarPage that is Instagram Biochemistry for today.